Go to the contacts phone booth. General Peter Randall, Hope, Idaho. I gotta get to the people to know the secret of the place. And Randall, you just know. <laughs> well, for those of you who couldn't hear, because stupid hint just had to get in the way and I didn't even realize it. Randall, you just made the top of the list. So, yeah, we consumed Elizabeth after all that time. It's crazy. I don't know. I always love how nonchalant he is about it. He doesn't. There's like no special animations for him consuming her. It's just him beating the ever living hell out of her, just like she's any other enemy. I love that. It just seems so stupid to me. Like for such an important boss, I feel like there should have been some specific assets to that one. <sighs> just for the EP, I'll kill you. Mainly because I'm pissed off that I didn't didn't manage to get uh, the one million or one point five mil that I was looking for. Extremely salty about that one. Like, look, now I'm at 909,000. Now that I... That's so annoying. Would you target the... No. Him. Yes. Boom. Bang, bang. Yeah, that's like the exact same punching that I used on Elizabeth. Nothing special. Just beat him up. Like, uh, so many lost opportunities. Not happy with that, but we're almost to the phone booth already, which is good. Oh, goodness. It's getting so intense. This is where the game gets super good and super worth playing, too. At least in my opinion. It's not bad up until this point, just combat semi-annoying, but, you know. Oh. oh, guess what? They finally know it's me. I'm so proud of them. There we go. That's a bunch of EP. Alright, let's begin this. too close too many times, but you have an advantage Blackwatch doesn't know about. You're growing immunity to blood tox. I think the key to McMullen is this. Attack the blood tox facility head on and let them think they have you. When they think they're in control, they'll bring you to McMullen. How do you know all this? I need a better idea of what I'm up against. Yep. We now have to infiltrate their facility to get to one person. Gotta love it. Must infiltrate the military. It's like, oh yeah, we're just gonna dupe them that hard somehow. I'll never understand that. But yeah, growing immunity to blood tox. Believe it or not, that is the thing, I guess. I mean, obviously a virus is gonna adapt. It's not easy to kill those things, but I mean, they don't really give any premise. It's just suddenly like, oh yeah, you've got the immunity. Don't worry about it, kid. But, I mean, hey, it's an extremely important part of the game, so I can't really argue it, I guess. No matter how stupid. Almost there, come on. Oh my gosh, that, uh, it's like pollution. Look at all that. Decodes, armor, gun emplacements. Great.
You know the drill. I want this in a storage unit ten minutes ago. Bring in the bird. We're moving this to the director. Now! Hi, boss. <laughs> That is a foolish thing to do. You know who I am. And you know what I do. You were always so smart. You were ready to give up all our secrets. So you infected me. No, no. Are you insane? But you always were a lateral thinker. Plans within plans. Put down the file and back away. Alex Mercer died. He died threatening to release the most deadly virus in history on the people of New York. You died in Penn Station, but the virus found its way into your bloodstream. And here you are, filling in the blanks. We were trying to figure it out. You just wanted to bring it all down. But this isn't what you came here for, is it? You want to know what happened at Hope, Idaho. You want the truth. I know the secret. Listen, there's nothing else you can do to hurt me. Well, <laughs> that took me forever. Like, I'm pretty sure I just spent like an hour trying to beat that mission until I was just so pissy that I couldn't talk anymore. So I'm just going to assume there's going to be music over that and just a compilation of me guerrilla tacticking the hell out of that because it's such a boring mission but such a difficult one. But, wow. You going to talk? Gonna going to talk? Guess not. Well, that was an extremely important mission nonetheless right there. The, this is... Oh my gosh, we're finally here. But that mission was super important just to say, like, hey, that was your boss when you were, like, actually Alex Mercer, and then it's like, he knows what happens. But no. And then he just kills himself. Like, <laughs> oof, now that I think about this one, I'm gonna want full health. Maybe it'll do it for me. I don't quite know, honestly, but... Oh my lord. Dude, I'm just... Oh my god, I'm just trying to get health back. Come on now. Oh man, I'm ready. This is gonna be great. At least I think I'm ready.
thought it was time we talk. You don't want to do that. I've done your job for you. I've broken the back of the infection. In a few hours, this whole place will be glass. Even Randall's not crazy enough to nuke Manhattan. You're wrong. He was at Hope in 69. He'll do anything to stop the infection. If you help me stop him, you get your secret. There's no way to get to that ship without being blown out of the sky. I have a way. Randall wants a colonel named Taggart. He sent me to find him. He's our key onto the Reagan. Taggart's massing a large force of helicopters at these locations. If we don't move now, he'll muscle his way out of Manhattan in a fleet of helicopters, and Randall might not be able to stop him. Mercer, take out the helicopters. I'll try and pin down Taggart's location, and don't let any of them get out of the city. Taggart could be on any one of them. Why does it seem like I'm getting the short end of this deal? Taggart has access to the helicopters he can get out anytime he wants. I can fix that. Oh my goodness, I hate this mission as well. I, uh, it's such a freaking pain. You have to chase down helicopters and just... Uh, really, really annoying. It's going to be a little bit time consuming, but we're so close to the end of the game. It's great. I'm so happy. Not just because it's over, but more like because I've actually managed to make it this far. So, Alright, first one. Honestly, I think I'm just going to continue to use the strategy I was using during my last mission, where I just jump into the whip fist, I'll target them, charge a kick, charge a whip fist, and it's pretty much a guaranteed kill just like that. I've never had it that efficient before, so it's probably going to go a lot quicker than I'm used to. No, come on, come on, Mercer. Charge kick, charge whip fist, go. Boom. Nice. Making really good progress already, and I'm very happy with that. Keep going. Just a little bit of back and forth, surprisingly, at least so far. Charge kick. Wow. That was... <laughs> that was an extremely quick area one, and I'm very happy with that. I'm getting a lot more efficient. <laughs> After so many times of playing this game, I'm glad it's finally happening. As much as I want that stupid web of intrigue target don't have time for it so oh my gosh it was right there whatever charge kick I'm not gonna oh my gosh I made it I don't even need to charge up the whip fist these things are so low health by the time I finish my kick which actually surprises me oh dude I remember this I remember what this looks like oh yeah throw it nice I think this is the last one actually there's one of them Charge kick, throw it in, whip fist it. Oh my gosh, I turned off my targeting. Get over here. Go. No, come on, let me hit this one, dude. Go. Thank you. Alright, now we're getting into the bit harder part where it's throwing two at us and they're gonna start going in stupidly separate directions. I already got the one though, so. Actually, I take that back. This one, for whatever reason, is actually coming to us. I don't remember it ever doing that, but hey, more power to me. Ah, oh, we're getting so much EP off this. I think, I think I'll actually be able to get drive a bullet, dot, bullet dive drop, whatever it is. I never, oh god, I've never been able to use it. So I'm actually like really curious how this will work. All right, so supposedly getting the maximum distance is you want to jump into the air and then glide and then as soon as you start to fall from that glide you dash glide again etc etc come here I really should be targeting the other one honestly because it's going to be further away from me yep knew that was going to happen at one of them charge kick throw the whip fist Boom, one. This other one's gonna get far enough away that's gonna annoy me to chase it down. But it's still surprisingly slow. Would you let me get on the building, please? Come on. I'm gonna lose this one, and that's not good. 
He cannot escape. We will not let him escape. Come here. Kicking, and of course. Well, I tried. Come here. Boom. Nice. kind of sucks because like they obviously don't let you know which one it is that he's in oh my gosh we're gone to three already and it's like no matter like if you dare lose one of them it's instantly implied he's in that one so <laughs> if you lose one have fun kid you're, you're gonna have to redo it obviously there's checkpoints but it's still an annoying mission at times i'm surprised how much i'm actually getting done and how quickly it's happening i'm never usually this fast on this mission this mission always takes me a while because it's so annoying having to track them down and like kick them twice while you're also on the run. That it annoys me. As do most missions in this game at this point. So, not really any reason to complain about this one any more than others. Come here. I need you. Web of Intrigue target. PhD, nice. Lucky you, dude. You're not lucky, uh, good work. Okay. But now you're a part of me, friend. I've got your knowledge. Charge kick, not gonna make it, knew it wasn't. Well, they just annoyed me. Ugh. Now I have to get all the way back in the air. I'm surprised I even managed to have half health. This is amazing to me. Go, Whitfus, go! Got it. Damn you for making me do this. <laughs> They're making it. There's so many random comments that I just can't really boost in volume, unfortunately. was a black watch project the goal of the experiment was to create a viral weapon that could be used to target specific racial types but hope went wrong a mutated virus infected all those people drove them mad their bodies crawled with hell and at the center of it all was elizabeth green and somehow she survived Endured the virus, absorbed it, changed it, whatever. Her unique biology inspired this new bioweapons research program. This became Gentech. And Alex Mercer worked for them. There was one leak too many and Randall stepped in to shut it down. No one was safe. Mercer fled the scene with a sample of the virus, took it as insurance if he needed it. Blackwatch cornered him at Penn Station. With his back to the wall, he unleashed the virus on Manhattan. What Mercer did is beyond forgiveness. But there is no Alex Mercer anymore. The virus didn't just kill him, it became him. Copied his body down to the genetic level. It became me. I am the virus. And I, in turn, released Elizabeth Green to infect the city a second time. Now she's dead. All right, but Randall won't accept that the virus can be stopped. And with Firebreak, he'll level the city, just like Hope. But now, Hope has one final riddle to give up. Green was pregnant when they found her in 69. What happened to that child? I suppose your answer is out there on the rig. All I know is, I'll get my answer from Randall. 